Hey guys, what's up? Daryl here. So in my last video, I reviewed the Shed's BI Movers. They're awesome because they're pixel mappable, have a large zoom range from four to 30 degrees, and unlike gobos, you aren't limited to just a few colors. You can implement smooth fades that cycle through all the colors. They're plenty bright for their compact size, being ideal for small to medium weddings. They have a rotate function that I was skeptical about. They kind of look like a quinta, which is not my favorite look, but I'm hoping with a solid color, it will look cool. I can test these lights in my garage all day long, but it really doesn't matter unless I try it at a wedding. I know you want to see them at a wedding. I want to see them at a wedding. So let's do it. And so I'll have links in the description below for all the equipment I'm using, but I'm using my both 360 Titan pixel tubes as well as my both IR4s for the up lights. So I had my photo booth attendant take some footage of this gig. I did not deploy my GoPro like I normally do. And the photo booth was super packed. So she was able to take some videos here and there in between sessions. So here you go. Please enjoy the clips that I do have. I feel like that this went pretty well. I wish that I had a little bit more room. I was a little squished between the bar and the buffet tables, but that's okay. I still think all things considered, it went pretty well. And it's quite common that us DJs aren't given all the room in the world, so we just have to make do with what we're given. So this was my first time using a BI mover at a gig. Um, I thought it did pretty good. I was a really big fan of the beams. I think that they looked awesome. Um, the rotate function I thought was pretty cool. It wasn't really bright when I was doing pixel mapping while rotating. I was a fan of the wash effect, although I do wish it had like a wider dispersion of wash. So they do have like other BI movers with even more. And they have like the Mac Auras, which are like 65 degrees of wash, which is similar to like a wash effects hack by Chauvet. So I do kind of wish I had that kind of spread instead of just 30 degrees. 30 degrees felt kind of narrow for a wash. But all things considered, I thought it was a pretty nice effect. Um, for 300 bucks, I mean, you can't go wrong with these movers. But these lights, I thought were pretty awesome. Like they were really nice to deploy. They're not too heavy. They're not too big. So what are your thoughts on the movers or any part of the production? Let me know what you think down below. And please smash like and subscribe. We are getting so close to 2,500 subs, and with your help, we can make that happen. We have so much viewership of this channel, but we are lacking the subs. So if you found this information helpful, please smash like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.